I've been practicing uh, dentistry for over 40 years now, and you really develop a close relationship with a lot of your patients who've been with you that long. And we like to treat all of our patients, even our new patients, as family. And I, I have the privilege of seeing sometimes two and three generations of family members. So when I can see a grandson uh, and the daughter, who's the mother of that, and also the dad who and the mom who brought that, that daughter in, or the young mother in now, in all in one day, that's really a pleasure and a treat for me. So the seeing three generations of, of family members is such an honor for me. Uh, and says a lot for the way we've been able to care for our patients. So people will ask me, are we still seeing families? Are we still seeing children? And yes, that is a very important part of our practice because we want to still nurture that side of our practice. The family is very important to us, whether it's celebrating their first eruption or the first loss of their tooth, their front tooth, if they're, if they're five years old or six years old, or whether it's they're two years old and we're seeing them for the first visit in our office. The, the family member can be as young as a couple weeks old to as even old as one of my oldest patients was 103 years old. But So that's my idea of family dentistry is just to welcome all new members, we'll treat you as family, and, and also to, to enjoy your family relationship for many, many years. I started coming before I was married and shortly after I got married my husband was looking for a dentist so he started coming here too and then with each of our kids we have four children and about when they were three years old we started bringing them to see Dr. Herringer um, and they, he'd start by just having them sit in the chair and count their teeth make sure they were comfortable here and um, look in the mirror kind of show him what he was doing and then as they got a little older we started cleaning them and um, they had to have a few fillings and things like that, so they're very supportive, very um, very nice, very good with the kids. You know, they have um, music they can listen to, they have little cartoons, they, glasses they can wear, or TV when they clean their teeth. Um, they're, you know, very gentle. They don't have never, you know, had any pain issues. Um, when Ethan was, was younger, he had to have a couple more extensive fillings, and it didn't even phase him, like when it was time to come back to the dentist, you know, sometimes kids are, that has, puts a fear in him and he's like, oh good, he just was ready to come back. He likes to get prizes, that's his favorite <laughs> thing to do after he's done, so. I have a few times we've had some people who've moved here and are looking for a dentist and we've given him his name and you know, said that we've had really good luck and really enjoy it here, so. I really like it here. Um, Dr. Herring and Herringer and all the staff are just super nice and um, it's, you know, good coming and just um, having like those nice people here and. Um, you know, not being like super like nervous or whatever and they're always super nice so it's that's great. You know when people ask me who I go to I always tell them and I tell them that he's super awesome and if they're looking for someone then I recommend him because he's great. Mm -hmm.